Right? I'm so violent. <laughs> So I'm turning 39 this year, and I want to look back at everything I've done and everything I want to do before I turn 40. My name is Jason, I'm a filmmaker, I'm a husband and a father of four, and I'm cleaning up the pre-40 bucket list. Bam! Is that good? This is the Nintendo Entertainment System. It was the talk of the town in every elementary school, probably high school. It was at the top of every Christmas list and birthday list. Which is what made me question why I got this. The Sega Master System. Better graphics, not as many games, but man was it cooler. The only problem, nobody had one. Everyone was rocking the Nintendo, except for one kid. So for this week's vlog, we're bringing my Sega Master System back to life. Welcome back, old friend. So we're gonna go see my old friend, Sean. Him and I have known each other since kindergarten. Spent seven years together in elementary school, and we got split up in high school, and we lost touch until, uh, essentially until today. We're gonna go to his tattoo shop. It's called DFA Tattoos. We're gonna get it all set up, and we're gonna play just like we did back in 1980. This is 80s. This is our 80s was totally affected by this. We were outcasts. We were totally on the fringes <laughs> because of this. Yeah. So when everyone's talking about Super Mario Brothers and Zelda. Never played it. Sorry. What the heck is Never that? heard of her. Was it a girl? I think. I brought my own controller. <laughs> Man, he thinks mine are rigged. <laughs> oh my god. What's gonna happen? That's snug. Still snug after all these years. <laughs> <laughs> We'll do easy, we'll do easy. Yeah, let's do easy. Okay. So when Christmas time would come around or birthday time or whatever, Everybody what system would you ask for? I asked for a Nintendo for Christmas. I got the Sega Master System instead. What'd you get for Christmas? <laughs> I got a Sega Master System, like, loser. I got a Nintendo. <laughs> That turns red. Oh, no. uh, I'm not supposed to shoot that guy. <laughs> Sean and I went to the same elementary school, so we were the real deal. You weren't Sean or Jay, man. You were trying to be Sean or Jay. <laughs> <laughs> My arm's already tired. Ugh, get, switch get, hit get, here. Get, 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 get. <laughs> oh, this game is hard, man. Yeah, yeah, it's really hard. Get, get that, get that. Imagine Fortnite lasted uh, 35 seconds like like this. I think Nintendo had had been out, I think, on the market already. I must have gotten Sega in 1988. I don't know how. I guess I, don't, I, can't, I wish I can go back to the conversation. Or why Sega? You know what the real reason was? It was because Sega was ten dollars less than Nintendo. <laughs> We were just like, what? You have Sega too? <laughs> <laughs> In the beginning of the 1990s, <laughs> violence was spreading throughout the entire world. It was the future, man. Right? <laughs> we gravitated towards each other, and from that point on, we played Sega probably throughout the rest of elementary school. <laughs> it's freaking sad. We can't get past the first round of anything. The game, game over. over. Should we cry or? <laughs> See you later, bro. Later, man. <laughs> Woo! It was the same. It was the exact same. And we're cleaning up the pre-40 bucket list, baby. Bam!